Welcome to the Updating MCS Templates with CA Unified Infrastructure Management version 851 video. In this video, I will show you how to move new versions of templates to production when you have existing configuration profiles. Before I show you how to move new versions of templates to production, let's go over a few key concepts. The MonConfig Service Probe and the MonConfig Service Templates Package are required to use Monitoring Configuration Service, or MCS. The Probe and the Templates Package are deployed to the primary hub during installation or upgrade. Templates are delivered in the MonConfig Service Templates Package. Templates are used to derive the profile types. Profile types appear on the Monitoring tab in Unified Service Manager. Use profile types to create configuration profiles for monitoring probes on target devices. See the MonConfig Service Probe release notes on the CAUIM Probe Stock Ops site for a list of available profile types. Every template has a template version. When you create a configuration profile, MCS uses templates that are in production. The template version used to create a configuration profile appears in the Profile Status section at the bottom of the configuration page. Every configuration profile you create is associated with the template version. Every templates package can have existing, new, or modified templates. When you upgrade CAUIM, a new version of the templates package is deployed to the primary hub. New templates and templates with no configuration profiles automatically move to production. There can be several versions of a template stored on UIM server, but only one version of a template can be in production. When you create a configuration profile, the version of a template in production at that time remains in production, even when newer versions of templates are available. When you're ready, you can manually move a newer template version into production, and Monitoring Configuration Service will automatically migrate the existing configuration for you. Now that we've reviewed the key concepts, let's get started. When a new MonConfig Service Templates package is deployed to your primary hub, MCS detects which templates are new, duplicates of existing templates, or new versions of existing templates. Upon successful deployment, MCS generates a summary report for each template that is in use but has a newer version. MCS won't update a template when it's in use for a configuration profile. We'll use Remote Desktop to look for summary reports. Here I've used Remote Desktop to log into the primary hub. I've navigated to the Reports folder where the summary reports are stored. In the Reports folder are reports that indicate new versions of the SAP ABAP and Setup SAP templates are available. The report names indicate that the Setup SAP template version 1.31 remains in production after the upgrade because a configuration profile associated with that template version exists in the system. The same is true for the SAP ABAP template. As we discussed earlier, we could leave these earlier versions of SAP templates in production. Here in Monitoring Configuration Service, we see the Setup SAP configuration profile that was created with template version 1.31. To move newer versions of templates to production, we'll use some probe utility commands available for the MCS probe. You issue these commands in Admin Console. The List Templates Versions command lists template versions for the entered profile type. The output also indicates the version of a template in production. The Activate Template command moves a newer template version to production and migrates the existing configuration profile. Use the Get Template Activation Status command to determine when the activation has successfully completed. To take a look at the Probe Utility commands, we need to access Admin Console. You can access Admin Console from Unified Service Manager. Click the Actions button and then select Admin Console. Select the Robots tab. Click the Primary Hub. Select the Probes tab. Enter MON in the filter to quickly go to the Mon Config Service Probe. Click the Inline Menu button in front of the Mon Config Service Probe, and then select the View Probe Utility in New Window option. We'll use the Activate Templates, Get Template Activation Status, and List Template Versions Probe Utility Commands. First, we want to verify the versions of the Setup SAP template stored on the UIM server. Select the List Template Versions command and enter Setup SAP as the template name. Click the green arrow to send the command request. Here, the command output lists the template version saved on the UIM server. Notice Table Entry 1 has production set to true. This indicates the Setup SAP template version 1.31 is currently in production. Using the probe utility in Admin Console, 
We have verified the same information provided with the summary reports. We record 1.32 because that's the version of the template we want to move to production. Now we'll select the Activate Template command. Enter Setup SAP in the Template Name field. Enter 1.32 for the template version we want to move to production. Next, click the green arrow to send the command. Record the activation ID. Note that the activation code is only displayed once. Now we'll see if the Setup SAP template version 1.32 is in production. Select the Get Template Activation Status command. Enter the activation code displayed after the Activate Template command was issued. And then click the green arrow to send the command request. The Success status indicates the new version of the Setup SAP template is now in production and the existing profiles were migrated. Depending on the number of configuration profiles MCS has to migrate to the new template version, it could take some time for the activation process to complete. In this case, you might see a status of in progress. You can continue to issue the Get Template Activation Status command periodically to check on the activation status. Let's take a look at the configuration profile in Monitoring Configuration Service. Here we see that all the information in the Profile Status section remains the same, but the template version changed to version 1.32. And if we issue the List Template Versions command again for the Setup SAP template, we see that the template version 1.32 is now in production. For more detailed information about updating MCS templates with CAUIM 851, click the Information bubble in the top right corner to load the product page. From there, you can go to Product Documentation, visit the CA Communities, or see the Learning Path.